You said this won't take time. Why not just go ahead and tell me while we're here? I trust there's a reason I left my sleep to be here. This attitude. That is why we are here. Both of you need to sort out whatever it is between you both. I mean, this can't go on forever. What can go on? A situation where you can be in the same room as she. What does that tell you? Renee's man needs to stop throwing herself at my man. <laughs> what am I even saying? Greg is not stupid to look at someone like her. Excuse you? You know, you keep throwing those stupid words at me. Something like you're trying to convince yourself that you're the perfect woman for him. Meaning? Meaning he is not yours in the first place. Get that into your head. Yeah, you may have some twisted feelings towards him. But as far as all of us are concerned here, it is unrequited. So I don't see the need for you to colonize him when he's totally unaware of your feelings. If I am you, I would be working towards confessing to him rather than trying to scare or intimidate me. Let me tell you something, Renes. Greg is not one of those idiots you dated back in college. Believe me, if he doesn't want you, being stark naked and throwing all kinds of seductive moves won't get him. Pick up your shredded dignity and move. Is that a challenge? Tell me, Stella. Is that a challenge? Are you trying to say that if I, Renes Milevinti, paraventure I want Greg, that I cannot get him? Did I stutter? Do you think I'm afraid of your antics? Let me tell you again. Renes me, even if you are stuck naked in front of Greg, he will not look at you. And if he does? He won't. Should we bet on it? I bet you. I like this challenge. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Um, now I got it. Um, oh my god, let me see. No, 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 it's okay, it's okay. Maybe I should just replace it. No, 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 no it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I can handle it. Yeah, it's okay. Enjoy. What? I, I can... It's okay, believe me. It's okay, don't beat yourself up, okay? You are going back inside? Yeah, I need to. Oh, yeah, sure, go ahead. I'm so sorry. It's okay, you don't have to beat yourself up. It's okay. Alright, have a nice day, yeah? Renesmee needs to stop throwing herself at my man. Greg is not stupid to look at someone like her. Let me tell you something, Renesmee. Greg is not one of those idiots you dated back in college. Believe me, if he doesn't want you, 
being stabbed naked and throwing all kinds of seductive moves want to get him. Pick up your shredded dignity and move. No, honestly, honestly, I'm like shocked that you're calling me. I won't even lie. I'm shocked. I mean, oh, okay. All right. So, to so what do I owe this special call today? You know, because I'm shocked. I got to be honest with you. And I've said that like a million times. Why? Because, I mean, all of Stella's friends, first of all, all of Stella's friends are like aloof with me, right? And uh, I'm sure like today's the first time I'm getting my number. <laughs> Truth or lie? Truth, truth. I always prefer the truth, okay? Okay. Let's say I have your number, you know. Oh, wow. So you've always had it. That makes it even kind of worse. <laughs> you've always had it and you're just calling me now. So wait, hold on. If you didn't see me the other day, would you have called me? Or would my number still be like a, a decoration on your phone? Just a placeholder? <laughs> 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 no, 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 no. Well, I just called to, you know, ask how I could make up for the other day. Okay, now we're talking. I like the sound of that. I like the sound of that. Uh, how about dinner? Dinner. Dinner? Yeah, dinner. You know, the thing where the guy asks a girl out, she says yes, he picks her up. They go to a nice restaurant, they eat, have a nice time eating. And when they're done having a nice time eating, the guy takes the girl, you know, and they go... I know what a dinner means, Mr. Phillips. I do. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, so... Fine. You've got yourself a date. Okay, a date. How about tomorrow by eight? That's okay. I'll be waiting. Have a good night rest. All right, have a nice night too, princess. Bye. Thursday, you with me. What's happening on Thursday that I don't know of? 
Nothing is happening on that day. Okay, then why can't you go to a movie date with me? You were the one who bought the ticket. You told me about the movie. And I've been looking forward to seeing why are you calling to cancel? It's not like I'm just bailing on you, right? Then what? I have a date, okay? Greg, don't tell me you want to cancel our movie night because of some girl you want to meet on Thursday. I'm sorry, Stella, but that's kind of what it looks like. Okay, look, I can't just not show up for her, you know? I was the one that suggested we go out in the first place, and it just, I blanked out, I forgot about it. You know, and I can't just call her now and cancel, you know? But you are calling me to cancel. Greg, what volume does that speak? It's not like that. Listen, I was... Just go to hell. Rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are you... How did you know where I live? You look beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, well, I, uh, I've been here before, though. Don't you remember? I came here with Stella. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> but what if I had moved? Uh, well, I would have to ask around to get your address. Here, this is for you. This is really thoughtful. But you didn't have to do any of this. I mean, coming all the way here to pick me. Well, remember when I told you over the phone, the guy picks up the girl and they go have food. <laughs> and, you know, it's a very crucial part of the whole thing, you know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you have it your way, Mr. Phillips. Mr. Phillips is my father. I'm not my father. Okay? Let's go. Finn? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry, let me just shut the door. All right, no, no problem. Thank you. You're good, right? Yeah, I'm good.
Why you sent for me? Yes, um, I brought out some clothes for laundry. But before you do that, help me check what's available so I choose what to eat. Yes, ma'am. Hello, baby girl! Oh, my yes! <laughs> Wait! Oh, my gosh! Yeah. Oh, my <laughs> God, I'm <laughs> Go! <laughs> this is me! Where have you been? Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness! <laughs> girl, I miss you! Is this you? Flesh and blood! <laughs> <laughs> It's good to see you. Oh, I miss you so, so much. Oh, I miss you more. Is it like um, a year or two? Oh, 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 oh. You're really guessing the time range. But that's because you cut everybody off in the name of marriage. Come on, girl. It's not like that, you uh. know. Work, uh -huh. family, uh -huh. husband, you know, husband. Let's just take a seat. Take a seat! <laughs> <laughs> You have a lot to catch up on, you know? I missed you so much. Mom, done. Um, okay, what would you like to have? Uh, I think I'll go with this. Okay, this drink I just put in the fridge, so just get one for her, okay? Girl, you're looking beautiful. You too. Oh. Oh. It looks good on you anyways. Oh, thank you, dear. How ah. is your husband? Ah. You are not serious. That's the newest Renee smell we never knew. That idiot's girl. Hasn't anyone told her that? That was the reason Andrew left her for her sister. Shouldn't you be worried? For what? Girlfriend, this is Greg we are talking about. A guy that you've been crushing on for God knows how long. And this bait of a game? It doesn't make any sense. Of course it does. It doesn't matter how she throws herself at him. It's not like that. My friend, we are talking about a guy. Guys barely keep it in control. It's not like that. Why do you think every girl that he has been with always comes back to him? That's because he's rare. He doesn't cheat. He's definitely not going to be with a hideous body. Right? All I'm saying is, you have to be very careful. You need to be very careful if you want to win this fight. Do you have to step up your game? Well, I'm not going to do anything. Yeah. I'm just going to sit here like this and watch her walk through that gate, get on her knees, and accept defeat. Hmm. She doesn't know me. I will make her regret looking at Greg in that way. She hasn't seen anything yet. Cheers to that. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, I'm at the venue. You'll be here in 10 minutes, Nora. Don't keep me waiting long. No. Okay, 7 5. That'll be fine. Sky. Oh, thank you for the time. Okay. Keeping the sweater. Kate! 
kids. Is this oh you? Oh my god. Come here. Oh. I really missed you, girl. Look at you. This is me live and direct. Girl, you're looking beautiful. Mm -hmm. Not to be compared to you. Girl, <laughs> had it been I've not known you for such a long time, I would have mistaken you for all these runway models. Oh, Look at yeah. You. <laughs> You can say that again. At some point, I was, you know. <laughs> of course, you are. You know what? Tracy will be so excited to see you. What? <laughs> what? Stop. She'll be so excited to see, you know, we could just arrange something like hang out, some catching up, just the five of us. Five? Yeah. The five of us. You, me, Tracy, Stella, and of course, uh, Renny uh, 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 uh. Don't even mention her name. Why do you think I would like to sit with any of you? Except for Stella, who was there when I needed a friend. Girl, it's actually not like that. I told you my dad was running for some political post, and... Practically all my phones went into that. My hands were tied. But Stella did. Stella was there for me as a friend. And none of you bothered to even call to check up on me to know how I was doing. And you, and you're here telling me that we need to sit down, the five of us? Not to talk of our almighty working class lady, Renesmee. She did not even send a cent to me. Kid. Hold on. And you sit here to tell me that I need to sit down with her and have a talk? We talk about what? That reminds me. I heard that she put a bed with Stella over a guy by name Greg. That's not what happened. Meanwhile, who's been feeding you with all that? You just got back. Girl, I just got back. But I know everything that has been going on. I, I can't believe you. You know very well that Stella has been having this undying crush over Greg for God knows how long. And you're supporting this whole thing. Who are you? Kids, who's been telling you all that? Of course, we are not supporting any of them. You mean we are going to support our friends to be at war with each other? Think about it. We have come a long way. Okay. Thank God you're back. At least you would help talk some sense into Stella. Tell her that all this nonsense she's doing is not necessary. How can she be fighting her friend over a man? Like, you're fighting your friend over a man. Did you just say friend? Mm -hmm. Do you know the meaning of friend? I don't think so. A friend is someone who will stand by you and not someone who stab you at the back. And Renes me is definitely not a friend. Kids. How can you be saying all this? That's not what's happening. You just go back for crying out loud. Hmm. They're still your friends. Let me give you a piece of advice. As a friend, when making friends, make sure you choose them wisely to avoid some future embarrassment. I'm just giving you a friendly advice. Choose your friends wisely before it's too late. <sighs> Kids, I think you need to calm down. You're getting this all wrong. Like, what? We're still friends. You're taking this too far. Calm down and you can settle this. We are sorry for what happened, you know? We are sorry. Let's let's just keep all this in the past. I miss the old kids. <laughs> Girl, we need you back. On behalf of everyone. We are sorry. <sighs> you 
it's okay. So, let's order for something. <laughs> so what are we doing? Red wine, chips and chicken. You know you love red wine. <laughs> please call the waiter, please. Sweet red right, to be precise. Waiter! <laughs> Hey. Hey. You came. Yeah, sure I did. Yes. Um, I didn't know what you would like, so I just grabbed this. Oh, you like it? I like it. Oh. <laughs> That's very thoughtful of you. Thank you. It's okay. Uh, oh, come on in. I'm so sorry. <laughs> there you go. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Hi, Renisman. How are you? I'm good. Hi, Alex. I didn't take you serious when Why? you told me you met over joining us. Oh, bro. <laughs> You're looking gorgeous. Uh, thank you. She is looking gorgeous, but Alex, get a hold of yourself, okay? <laughs> oh, I see you guys have been drinking. Yeah, yeah. just uh, yeah. Okay, why don't I just cook up something? You want to cook? Sure. Shouldn't I? Yeah, yeah, sure. Of course. Um, yeah, sure. Um, let me show you to the kitchen. Oh, that'll be nice. Just keep this here. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. What were you thinking? Inviting her over to your house? What? And she's using your kitchen? Bro, calm down. Okay? Man, I, I didn't come here to eat food poison. Bro, first of all, that's offensive. Secondly, you're taking it too far, okay? You're exaggerating this. Greg, okay. Greg. What? I am not going to eat whatever that girl is going to uh, prepare now. Bro, you're being dramatic right now. I don't even care. Like, you're being too dramatic, okay? Say, have you tasted her food before? No, but that doesn't, that, doesn't, that doesn't mean that she can't cook. Oh, I see. Yeah, she offered. Okay. Okay. And then she told you she wants to use your kitchen and you allowed her. Bro, do you want to say that she doesn't look like somebody that can't cook? Greg, listen. Yeah. That girl doesn't look like somebody who had no knife before in a lifetime. Sorry. Uh, hey, hey. Yeah, I uh, I can't seem to figure out how to turn on the cooker. Can you please help me out? I was trying to. Uh, yeah, yeah sure, 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 Alex. Mm -hmm. no, no, I got it. I got it. Okay. Yeah, sure, of course. <laughs> it was quite, you know. You know, it's like gas, it could explode. And stuff. Yeah, that's yeah. why I need you to turn it on. No, no, I got it. I got it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. It's my special recipe. Oh. Bro, take it easy so you don't choke yourself. <laughs> <laughs> this tastes real good. You said that, yeah. So good. It's a special recipe. Yeah. yeah. Um, actually, Louisa and some friends helped. Louisa? Yes. My nanny. Oh. Okay. She's dead now. Oh. So sorry about that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so sorry to hear that. It's okay. It's fine. Sorry about that. Mm -hmm. You're right. This is good. Oh, thank you. Good. Thank oh. you. <laughs> You're impressed, babe. <laughs> Hello? Ben? Hold on. Slow down. Just calm down, I'll be there. Yeah, yeah, no, of course. Yeah, I'll be there, okay? Just calm down. Ben. Ah, thank you. 
my friend needs me. Okay, I'll be back in a, I'll be back in a bit. Okay, okay, I'll be back before you go. Just make yourself comfortable. Okay, thank you so much for the food. I'll be back. Stressed. He's in very bad shape. Like he almost overdosed before we got there. He's doing very bad. I didn't know it was this bad, you know? Calm down, okay? You're not going to lose him. I, I don't know about that. I doubt that, okay? I mean, do you know that he called me? You were there. He called me to come save his life. He was overdosing. And before we got there, he smoked his last stash. No, we could have found him dead. He didn't care about dying or living. He just smoked his last stash. Who does that? He, like it's very bad. He really needs help. He needs help and we're helping. We're helping, we're doing what we can. I mean, his family doesn't want to see him like this. You know, no one wants to see him like this. But he just doesn't want to stop. We try to get him to rehab, he doesn't want to go to rehab. He doesn't want help, he keeps on turning down help. Did you take him to the hospital? We had to take him to the hospital. He was almost overdosing. I thought he was going to die. So they flushed it out of his system? They flushed a lot out of his system. I was shocked. Shocked. He's been doing way too much. I don't know if there's hope. It's okay. You need to rest. You too. I'm so sorry I left you all night. It's okay. I'm sorry. It's fine. I'm still a little cute for someone that just snapped. <laughs> Stop it. I'll be honest. <laughs> Stop it. Stella. Holy hell. You won't believe what I'm seeing right now. Stella! Okay, and I, I think for you to say it, you'll see us figure out. Craig. Oh, hey, Stella. What's up? Do you have a. So, it, this is it. It's her, right? All these excuses of not having time to do anything, this is it. This bitch got you oh. wrapped up in her fingers that you suddenly forgot you have a friend. Would you stop, okay? You're making a scene. I'm making a scene? Yes, you're making a scene. I got you cheat doing this shit and this is all you've got to say? Babe. Um, Greg. Stella. We're friends, okay? We're just friends. You're not my girlfriend. Okay, let's learn to draw the line, please. Greg, are you saying this because she's here? Could you stop, okay? You're embarrassing everybody. You are the one embarrassing yourself. Bringing up all these stories because you're with one slot. What? That's enough. What's that about? I wouldn't just sit here and watch you insult her. Why would you do that? Insult who, please? Who is she again? Ah, uh, Greg, who is she? Greg. Greg. Greg, where are you going with her? Greg! 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 Yeah. What 
what's going on though? Like, why is she like that with you? Is there something going on between the both of you? I don't know. You don't? I mean, she seemed furious. Clearly at you, not me. I don't understand. Why would she be furious at me? That doesn't... Please make me understand. I guess she doesn't like the idea of you and I being friends. Huh. You think so? I feel so. You're okay though, right? Yeah. Okay. okay. Are you drunk? I'm asking you, are you drunk? Go in there and tell your stupid boss to come up right now. Madam. Like I said, my, my boss is not here. She went out for lunch and I don't think she'll come back anytime soon. Are you not? Stella, I don't like this. I don't like it either. She's stealing my man. Baby girl, you will lose your chance with him if you continue like this. Listen to me and let's go. Go in there and tell Renes I want to see her now. I would listen to her if I were you. You little cunning bitch. So you've been seeing Greg behind me? I owe you no apologies. Tell me, how were you able to convince him that you are this good girl? So he can see you in the light, right? Baffles me who was now below the belt. You and Greg can never happen. Siphon, I need the document from Mr. Timmy. You must really like this great guy a lot. Andrew, you either tell me why you're here or you leave. I want to resign. You want to resign? I mean, I am the vice chairman here. I am supposed to be the front man. But no, instead I'm busy running errands for one CEO and get nothing in return. I want to resign. I am reassigning your secretary to one of the heads of the department. What? You see, this is it. This is what I've been complaining about. You guys just assigned to me some, some title with, without powers. How do you think I feel? You want to resign my secretary? You know, this, this is the height of it. No, no, no. Tell me. Tell me. If you resign, what will you do? Roaming around the streets? I mean, picking pockets? You will be in a better position to answer that when your father finds out that you're fighting some girl over some, some, some silly guy. Oh, that will make his day, da. Now back to my question. What will you do when you go back to the street? Get it. But fighting that girl in public will not solve anything. I see red whenever I see her. 
girl. This is a game between you two. She has the best and the most advanced strategy to win. It doesn't matter how many times you drag her or shout or drag her in the mud. You know her very well. You know that she likes challenges more than revenge. All you need to do now is to think of how to get back everything that you have lost. I want to hit her. I want to hit her with hot. Why not use the opportunity now? What opportunity? What? I mean, you, Stella, this whole thing, is it really necessary? I don't get. Oh, what has Stella got to do with this? Everything. It seems like you both are in this unending war. Girl, it's about to swallow you and you don't even know it. Look, friend me. I know you are challenged. I know how much challenges intrigue you. But come on, you don't have to keep taking her bait. Without you knowing it, you, 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 you're dancing to her tunes. And this is not the you we know. Girls, 
I get. I get it all. I understand you're worried. But I can assure you, I know what I'm doing. Okay? Do you? Really? <laughs> Girl, the last time I checked, it seemed like you both are trying to drag the heart of an innocent man. And if you ask me, it's really not fair. I know, I, I, I understand it's not fair. I don't need you to spell it out. I, I, I didn't know him that much. I, but getting close to him, it has made me see him in a different light. And he's, he's, he's such a nice guy. Venice, me. You have to stop. Stop everything you are doing with this guy before it becomes too late. Rene, you need to listen to Tracy. someone I've never seen in my entire life. Like, this is my first time seeing you. Know, you look like a an 80s princess right now. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> no, she's actually beautiful. Uh, you sure know how to flatter me, Greg. <laughs> Thank you. You don't look bad yourself. Well, I appreciate that. I'm not flattering you, okay? You look amazing. Thank you. you. Know, everything, the shoes, the hair. <laughs> yeah? Thank you. You're welcome. Why don't you make yourself comfortable? Oh, ah, sure. I'll come join you in a second. All right. The hair is so empty. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, in dead, Stella is looking stunning tonight. Yeah, Woo! sure, sure. Yeah. She's beautiful. Hello. Yeah. Very cool. Wow, wow, wow. This is so, so beautiful. This, you probably heard this. She's an angel. Hi. Hi. Has anyone told you this nickname? That you're the most beautiful woman in this party tonight, <laughs> right now? No one has, but. Thank you. It's coming from me. You're actually <laughs> beautiful, babe. Wow. So you guys, oh, Carol was thinking the beautiful damsel needed a knight in shining armor. <laughs> I guess I have to turn my cavalry around and go someone that actually needs me, you know? Too bad. I guess. Well, you know, Greg, you don't need to talk from this stance until you can come closer, okay? Thank you, thank you. Wait, so, what in the... Beautiful damsel, you know, who neglected. <laughs> Trust me, Knight. This damsel has gotten to a certain level in life where being neglected doesn't mean much. Nice. But just so you know, if I may, well, 
you're a pretty damsel and I want you to know that this knight would never let anyone hurt you. Okay? You're so pretty for that, okay? You look amazing. I'm going to stick by you all night. Make sure you have a great time, you know? I'm your personal bodyguard today. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Why don't we go sit? Okay? Okay. Ladies first. Okay, guys. Mm. <laughs> nice to <laughs> Whoa! What? How could you? Are you okay? I'm so sorry about this. Sorry, sir. Yeah. Why don't you just... trying to do I tried to warn you but you wouldn't listen to me did you see them did you see them that standing was it comprehensive they all saw everything oh my god Stella when will you learn to control your temper now you have given her the upper hand <sighs> this doesn't seem like a game to me it's not the game I thought it is I feel there is something really really wrong somewhere like what? Are you not seeing it? Are you not? The way he looks at her, the smiles, the tender, soft touches. I've never seen Grey like that with any woman. Grey fall for Renee's me. Just like that. What do you think this is? Some soap opera? Huh? Kate. You were the one that told me that, hideous or not, men will always be men. Did you see the way he was looking at her? That is how men look at women they love. Stella, you need to calm down. You really, really need to calm down. Do you think she's going to win this? No. Tell me, are you accepting defeat just like that? Girl, I know you messed up. You really, really messed up big time. But you have great opportunity to make amends. Let me tell you. Opportunity will come where you're going to hit her, where it's going to hurt her the most. She can't have the last laugh. She can't. She won't. She won't. Stella. You need to find out. How Greg feels about this.
What are you doing here? In his shirt? Did you sleep with him? You are so, so despicable. Is this what you do now? I mean, you resorted to every means possible just so you could have him? Stop, Stella. The last thing I want to do is be cowards with you. You are a slut! Baker, what's with who? I mean, I can't believe you could go this far just to win a common bet. Renee Smith, how? You love Stella. You were the one who brought up this challenge. And I'm winning, so why are you complaining? You are a bitch. That's what you are. What? You think by doing all this, Greg is going to suddenly develop some sort of feelings for you? Is that what you think? <laughs> Let me tell you, Renee Smith. Greg will not see you as anything but the game that you are. What's the bet? What's the bet? No, no, just just shush. I'm going to tell you. I have to tell you. This bitch and I made a deal on you no, no, no. because she can't seem to get her head no. out of the gutter that she can't have you to herself. No, no, baby, 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 no, don't, don't How listen much? to. How much am I worth? Baby, baby, you, you're worth everything to me. You're worth my love. Shut up! Hey, do not. Greg, 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 Touched by love. This is a matter, a matter. 